London, England. In 1854, the largest city in the industrial world, with a population of two and a half million. And the smelliest one. Raw sewage is dumped straight into the streets and river. Underground streams and wells are polluted by leaking cesspools and sewers. London stinks, and death takes its toll. In the summer of 1854, another devastating cholera epidemic breaks out. It strikes the Soho neighborhood of London. In a single night, 200 people show signs of the deadly disease. Within hours, they die of dehydration. 10 days later, over 600 people are dead. Most people believe the disease is spread by foul-smelling air. But a young doctor has another theory. John Snow suspects cholera is spread by contaminated water. The doctor starts investigating. Going door to door, he keeps track of all cholera cases in Soho. Drawing a dot for each case on a map, a pattern emerges. The cases concentrate in a small area around Broad Street. What's the link between these people? They all take their drinking water from the water pump in Broad Street. John Snow is sure the Broad Street pump is the killer. The doctor persuades local authorities to remove the pump handle. No handle, no water, no more cases of cholera. The outbreak stops. John Snow simply gathered and plotted data points. Then he turned this data into actionable insight. People like John Snow started a revolution in healthcare that is still going on.